Baker's founded in 1973. A big watershed moment in the business was 2006, when we first invested in digital technology with HP. That really made a big change to the business. Really, really big change. And then in 2024, our biggest ever single investment was the 200K, again with HP. We obviously understood the technology, we understand how it works because of what happened in labels before, but it gave us that comfort to move into another sector, into flexible packaging, knowing that we understood the print side of things, but still different presses and brought their own challenges themselves. I feel like the modern buyer has sort of transitioned into different priorities. So speed, and lead time has become almost the utmost priority. And in that scenario, we need to support them to do so. We want the best kit, the best pouch making ability, the best lamination, and naturally the best print. So that led us towards the 200K again. We know that flexible packaging is a great product. We know how important it can be, I mean, it's incredibly light, it's incredibly strong, it keeps food waste down to a minimum, and we just need to be responsible in the way that we use it to make sure we're getting the most out of the, what is a great product. So to be on the forefront of the development of that going through the next so many years, to make flexible packaging more and more sustainable, it's a subject that's close to our heart, and it, and it, it, it will give you a feel-good factor that, the fact that we are making the world a better place, less plastic waste, less food waste, and, and all of that encapsulates into our, our ethos of, uh, of a packaging provider. Well, I think digital printers had a big impact. I think the traditional view of a printer's is starting to turn, and I think it's something that we are trying to push as a business to promote that the industry has changed and it's turned. I think it's made it a more sexy industry. It's now tech heavy. These are very, very sophisticated bits of kits that people are working on, which makes it attractive for younger people to get involved. As a company, we try to stay on the technical forefront and innovate as much as possible. We've always got an eye on what HP is doing. The technology is constantly moving forward. I think we feel that confidence that there'll always be that next solution. We're not worried with HP that it's suddenly going to come to a halt and we're going to have to just have this technology. It's ever evolving. So we're thinking now about what the next investment might be in 12 months, in 24 months, in three years, in five years. And we have that transparency with HP. So we're able to understand just where we are now and what we're doing, but where we're going as well. We're here to disrupt the market and we're going to use HP to do so.